why do you think um, you know, your brand popped off, I guess? Because like, you know. it's sick. <laughs> the time has come. Why are you shaking, bro? Um, I feel going training with Hunter. I was hoping this time wouldn't come, but it's coming. I'll check back in later. It's out here too, bro. two kettlebells and a yeah. TRX band. It was over the years, just kept on kicking ass and slowly building up. I love it, man. I love so, it. We have people out here trying to do whatever we want. Like, oh, we could counts. be in the Mediterranean, yeah. From this point right here, you can see the snow-capped mountains down. I mean, you can't see it right now because of the fog, but you can yeah. see the snow-capped mountains, the tallest mountains in uh, Southern California. This is like tranquility, isn't it? Yeah, is isolation zone. Yeah. yeah. We move things that are heavy, but we don't do like bodybuilding. Mm -hmm. um, and then well, we I'm out. on the team. I'm training every day. Uh, so like, you know, I'm not six days a week for about four hours. Yeah, like we I mean, just fall high rocks. Just for high rocks. Yeah. I was trying to go for the Olympics for paddling. Because um, I just started studying these guys. Now my grandfather was a Masters Olympian, and I was like, I'd like to keep it in the family. Yeah. All right, so you in here like three, four hours a day. I try to stay outside, honestly. I'm in the gym probably 10 hours a week, maybe just on the machines and stuff and lifting. You know, most of it, like I won't touch barbells more than twice a week. Oh, really? Yeah. We body build in the off season. Like I'll get up to 200, like, I don't know, 98 kilos. What do you weigh now? So me right now, Jesus. 92. <laughs> yeah, 92. And I'll try to get down to like 90 to 89, 88. It don't make a big difference. Okay. Starve yeah. yourself. Really? Yeah. Well, then how can you uh, perform? I'm still strong as all hell, man. Like today, I'll, we'll be back squatting um, like four, four and a half plates. You only go down to a box and just kind of jam yourself out and lift as heavy as you can. And you can body able to hold tension yeah. just for small periods of time. It will be strong on that. It will be strong on the rower, strong on the sled. And then my lungs just never get tired. So that's, that's the most important thing in a high rocks is an hour long. Yeah. Wait. I bet you didn't think he was going to say four and a half plates. I thought we were going for a jog. Look how much weight he's got on this slide. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to not feel sad. That's the, your problem. You will just you know, fucking show up. Yeah. But bro, I can't. I, my squat's terrible. Right, bro, I can help me squat a barbell. <laughs> no, you're going to show up now. Yeah, bro. Fucking go, baby. I'm taking three workouts. Right, so we do a lot of running for high rocks. Yeah. But how, how are you squatting so heavy and man maintaining the, like, the speed and the... I just train separate times a year. So like we'll bulk up for like two or three months, lift as much as you can, do as little cardio as you can. Really switch it. And then you start to kind of, I do this thing where I do like a 70-30 split. So it's like 70% strength, 30% time outside. And then you start to go kind of 60-40 and then you start to go 50-50. Right. And then all of a sudden you start to go backwards. So now I'm spending, you know, probably 20% of my time in the gym lifting heavy, and I'm just holding on to what I, I built later. And now I'm just outside in the mountains, biking 10, 12 hours a week, running six hours a week, on the stations another six hours a week. Um, in reality, like all you want to do is I keep most of my weights this time of year just as a checkup to make sure that I'm not yeah. dropping. Because right, right, right. if you start dropping, then all of a sudden you're like, okay, I'm overtraining. Let's go back a little bit and then go back again. You'll be good. These old ones. Oh yeah, dude. I have a bunch more in my house. A bunch more in my closet too. So this is where I started my career. If you guys want to hear the tour. Yeah, no, so I started my career 
with Spartan Race, you know, obviously, like I started road running, I dropped out of college, I was like, this isn't it. Like studying books to go do stuff that other people want me to do is not my life. Like I wanna be an athlete. Yeah. So I do a couple road running races. I found my first Spartan Race in 2013, no, sorry, 2011. I will be that. I was 21 or 22, 22. And I was like, this is it. Like it feels right. Yeah. And at the time, it had just started to catch up, and I went and I ran my second one about six months later. So I went in secrecy and started to train. I took second place or third place there, and then I get a call from the CEO, and they're like, our number one guy just dropped out. Do you want to fly down to Mexico? We have a project where we're putting out a head, head hunter. Yeah. We're basically like, it's just a $10,000 prize, prize purse on your head. And I was like, okay. So they just fly me down to Mexico, and then all of a sudden I go from Mexico to New York City, then I go from New York City to Vermont, and I'm just like all over the world now. It happened literally within three months we started. On world title, world title, national title, world title, national title, world title, world title, world title. We're all good. Yeah. That's the world record for Murph. Uh, this is a story. Wait, 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 what's the time? It's 34.13, but my best time was 30, <laughs> 31 minutes. <laughs> But I can, Let's I go can, home. I can break 30. I can really? break 30. Yeah, I'll do oh it. I'll God. do it in the fall. What do you do like about your diet? Do you follow strict and eat whatever you want? I eat McDonald's. I eat more <laughs> sugar than any human being you've ever met. Uh, Love lots that. of Cheerios, steak. <laughs> you just, you just try. I, so I go from steak to chicken. Yeah. And instead of like ice cream at night time, I do yogurt. We're gonna switch every minute, guys. Yeah. Right. We're only gonna do three rounds to get your blood flowing. I've never been ner more nervous for a workout in my life. Hunter told me that the whole workout is at conversation pace. I can't speak. <laughs> Five seconds. Where are you guys sitting while you're here? Uh, just in the public with bills. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. I like having a pool and doing stuff. Yeah, I don't think I can live that. Are you a UK guy for life? No, I want to. I want to be here. Really? Yeah, yeah, that's why I come so much. The goal is higher. Only Brian could. Roman Granikoff was said he could beat you. Yeah, I know. I said twenty thousand dollars cash if he can. He's a good guy though. He's, a, he's sick. I, I like him. I feel like he, he yeah. might win the game. Sure. He yeah. will win the game. Let's go, brother. Oh, pass. There you go. There you go. Easy. Come on, man. Don't let's go, baby. Yep. Oh. Pass. Yeah, you're at the end because you're just, you're there. You're, yeah. you're absolute limit. And you're just doing these lunges, just smacking your knee into the ground, smack. And because the only way to get it done faster is just to bounce out of the hole, just boom, boom, boom. boom. Yeah. And you're so efficient in burpees. Your Dude, burpee yeah, technique. I wanted to ask if you could show us how you do your burpees, because you're like a frog. Totally. Yeah, I call it the frog hop or the hunter hop. I'll show you guys after this. Let's go, boys. Come on. Come on. Hold You got some color on the bar now? Yeah, a few later. Come on, let's go. All about the core, baby. Easy. Uh, yeah. Come on, again, again. One more, one more. Yeah. Again, again. Well, you alive? Fuck me. Stand up, there you go. Up again. Crazy. Woo. Oh my 
Yeah, you left. I'm gonna get that 150 to that. Oh. We, we put it on the fans, <laughs> boys, so you get a little bit extra horsepower. <laughs> yeah. Come on, boys. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Go, yeah, yeah. go, come go, on. go, 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 go. No. Oh. oh. That felt. I felt that. All right, now we're gonna work some biceps, boys, and then we'll start getting in our intervals. That's how you win races. Yeah. <laughs> Savage, it's full of water as well. Yeah. Now you're a field worker, baby. <laughs> <laughs> What's the hook? Sled push. Ah. Oh. Did you want it? You're good right here. I'll roll over. Two techniques that everyone uses. I'll show you the one that I don't like, but it's here. Boom, boom, jump. Yes. That will like save you technically a little bit of energy up in here. But what I like to do is I like to keep my burpees off of all of the reflexive muscles. So when I get up, it loads my hamstrings and I explode out. So I just do a hop. So I'm down here, boom, boom. Right. So, so as soon as your feet. Really, you? Nope. So I pretend when I teach people, I hold like a broomstick, like right here. Mm. And I'm like, just stay low. Because every inch you move up is an inch you're moving the wrong, like in the wrong direction. So as soon as your feet hit here, yep. you're gonna kind of do like a little bit of a push up and jump. Hard work, okay, here we go. effort on Tuesdays. So hard interval runs in the morning, max lifts in the afternoon. It's good to have a good crew with me. It's really what makes the difference. I mean, we'll get it done alone, but it's a lot more fun with friends. Let's go, bro. Get down. On flat, on what? Yeah, flat. Yeah. This time of year, we usually run mountain in the off season. Yeah. This time of year, it's just paving time. Come on, get it again. Another one. Let's go, go big jump. Count it, let's go. you possibly can on the treadmill for 60 seconds. You're gonna come over, you're gonna throw your vest on, yeah. and you're gonna wait, and you're gonna lunge. Okay. Uh, we'll do 405. Huh? So same thing, repeat. <laughs> Fuck, this is hard. Thumbs up. And four times back and forth. Just gotta chuck it over the shoulders like a backpack. I don't mind lunges. Sure. But lunges after sprinting. You can't breathe and he's singing. <laughs> I'm not, can't speak. 
I'm coming third today. I'm still on the podium. What were you saying to yourself on the treadmill? Ah, uh, no one's gonna fucking stop me. They don't have a chance. I worked too hard. I want it too bad. It's been mine. I'm just gonna wear it that day. Keep it as long as I want to. We got one more. We'll be done soon. I promise. Nobody gets a chance to do this. Yeah. We're literally got the, we've got the fucking chance to train with the fucking number one Hyrox motherfucker in the world. <laughs> Hunter, if you had a partner exactly the same stats as you, what yeah. do you think you could do Hyrox in? The doubles? Yeah. I don't know, like 46, 47? <laughs> we could have done like 49 or 48 if we had just like, do. when we did it in London, it was, it might as well have been a parade. It was the first oh, one that they had ever people. done. Dude, it was crazy. Yeah. We were screaming at people. We got in a fight with one guy. Because they're just like, you just kept on laughing. We're like, dude, just stay out of the fast lane. Oh, I paid my mom ticket too. And I'm like, I didn't know you did. But we were, it was just, it was a mob. All right, so what we do here, same thing. Go as hard as you can for 30 seconds. Yeah. And then three pushes. thing called uh, the throw up test. So I used to have people come up here, I didn't put them through up, but nine times out of 10 people throw up. Really? Yeah, I used to be sponsored by this beat company too. So they give them this red drink and they throw up and it looked oh, like the a beat shot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> that was beautiful. Thank you. Good job, I dude. appreciate that. Why did you get that or I'll shoot your text? It's like a full mountain camo. Oh, sorry, right, yeah. Like shorts, hoodie, tees, vest. It doesn't come out till like later on this year, but. I got it. Thanks, brother, man. I love your guys' gear. I live in your guys' uh, blue sweater all throughout Europe. It looks sick on the runs. <laughs> Dude, Thanks. this is solid. Did, what do you think? Give me the vote. What do you guys, how do you think you guys did? 10 out of 10, bro. <laughs> <laughs> now, that was hard. That was very hard. It was good, though. Dude, I'm really glad you guys came up. Yeah. It's I, fun to show people what it's like to do this. I mean, like, that's why I got into this business. I used to be a group fitness instructor. I love training with people. Appreciate the hustle. Do you bring people up and you just bottle it? Or yeah. you think they're going to be a savage and you're not? I mean, you want to know the truth? Um, I'm so used to training camps and everybody gives me their heart and soul on day one, workout one, and then it's just like down from there. But the fact you guys kept on showing up, I really always just like to put, stand next to people and I find out where their limits are and I keep them trying to keep them there. Like, I found your number, I found your number. I was like, let's just go. Yeah. And that's the best thing you can do, mm -hmm. you know? Nobody has to match me, you just have to match your best. Who do you train with just yourself to like push you? Because you said that the other day on Twitter, like yeah. you're the sickest guy in your gym. Then you fucked. I'm really lucky where I, I play like a game of just, uh, just like cards. Like I put, shuffle my deck up all the time. Like this morning I was running with the Nike Marathon coach. Um, you know, I got you guys, you push me through intervals. If I'm gonna go lift, I go down to the gym and I know some guys that will yeah. like really bend and steal. I've also got a lot of really good crews. I, if people seem to be in soft, like my homies will call me. 
Like, don't be a bitch today. Yeah. 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 You guys are always welcome back. Thank you. Thanks for the grind, dude. Sure, it's just up the hill, make that quick left, and as long as you're going down, you're going home. All right. See ya. <laughs> See ya. Most fun session, yeah. Hardest training session I've ever done in my life. Yep.